Hi everyone, welcome back to Abra Knowledge Channel. Today's topic is all about XMind. XMind is a wonderful application in which you can create many flowcharts or any info path diagrams and all that. It can be easily created. And uh, in this video, you are going to cover two things. One, how to download it. Second one, few example of XMind which we are going to mull over today and this video is all about just to give you because I've been using this one just for a while I find it very useful I thought that to share it this insights or tidbit along with you and this video is not about the ad about the XMind and all that it is just giving you like what is the benefit of using that XMind as such let's have a go so in order to download it, this link uh, that xmind.net, I will be giving in the chat and in the description and I will be giving it where you can pick it up uh, slash download represent that it will directly go to the download page. And we, if, you, if you are a Mac user, then you can just have a go and download it. If you are a window user, you can have a go and use it. For example, if you upon you click here and it will show like dot exe file will open up and which you can save it and all that i have already downloaded so i'm not going to run that one so it comes with the 64 bit and all that and then you have another one the linux one and you are ipad one or even for mobile right for android and ios which you can make use of it right so the version which I have is a basic version and a trial version and I may have a very limited uh, uh, the features. Anyway, I will just demonstrate quickly what are the things which we can have using XMind. So I'm just opening up the new file, a uh, new library. Okay, and this is the XMind typical one where you will find two ribbon one is new the other one is library new where you find like quick uh, whatever the things uh, has come up newly it will come for example let's say central topic like main topic and main subtopic or whatever whatever the things you have these are all the things which has come up uh, newly it will come up right so this is uh, one and also you can open up uh, the file which you have the text mind uh, version or the recent file which you have created you can also open up but what i am going to explain today is more from the library one where you will find lot mini format readily available and more importantly it is in the editable format so let me demonstrate two or three example first example is and we are gonna see that fishbone diagram uh, like missed deadline is a theme which we are gonna talk about it Another one which I find it very very useful is automation flow whenever you wanted to do that the flow charts and all that this is also one easy way to do it and uh, one other one which I find it very interesting is green food like how we can have a you know connectivity from the nutrition perspective and all that so and of course there are also another formats are also available which you can explore and which you can definitely make use of it so you have a mode maps and more related to maps come up so let's talk about the first example the fishbone using xmind so uh, you can have a go and click it and uh, it will come up so now you can i'm just using like uh, once again that is a trial version i may have a limited uh, access as such so this is the window like actually like fishbone diagram where you will find all this in 6m man machine method material method uh, material mother natures and all that right let's say you wanted to change that uh, environment into mother nature example right you can do it and you wanted to change like missed deadline and this missed uh, deadline is because of these are all the causes let's say you wanted to change anything let's say this one uh, due to rain continuous rain and you wanted to write you can just have a go and double click and then you can write it 
and uh, now you want this is on the mind where, wherever on the icons and all that even this icon can be changed and this text can be changed and all that let's say that you want to have a, a different color so you, we, now you can see only one color and you wanted to have a different colors and all that right you wanted to explore more on this so you can go to outliner also as well this is also i find it very useful and here from here also you can do it for example let's say uh, you know the for test for training example i'm just get, uh, adding it here and uh, maybe we can put it some dates and all that we can put it uh, let's say i'm just uh, missed deadline in the project and uh, the causes maybe fish bone on missed deadline and then i'm creating to today's uh, date 22 date is one and month is five and let's say prepared by example let's say i wanted to have channel name branale channel so you can have and whatever the uh, you you can edit you can edit it or even if you wanted to have this uh, you know the different thing which you can do it also as well right so let's go and see in the main page so i made some changes let's see whether it's been reflected so you see here uh, so miss a deadline for the training purpose and then whatever the changes i made it it has been reflected you can see here and uh, the basic info also as well project name date and prepared by and all that it has come very well and apart from this if you wanted to have like some insert if you wanted to have you can of course you can do it or in the panels if you wanted to have any things like extra which you can also have that also from the panel also as well very very uh, useful uh, for example in the panels i wanted to have a borders or, or uh, you wanted to have different things you can of course you can have it for example you wanted to have a reactions flags arrow and uh, you know academics and if you wanted to have different things uh, and like symbols uh, it gives you very very th uh, you know fantastic symbols are available which you can definitely make use of it uh, similarly like if you wanted to have some other icons you can definitely use it and uh, and then i'm just coming back here and this is multi branch color if you enable it even it will give now it is only in orange so if you want multi color you can be you can just use it like it has come in multi color and then you wanted to have uh, the compact you can have it uh, like you know all will show in one compact one and the topic overlap also you can do or uh, justify tom uh, you can just uh, adjust it and then font size let's say you wanted to change the font size let's say you wanted to change the font size to maybe something formal maybe arial or uh, you know the ms gothic and all that if you wanted to do it has it has changed it very very fast so it is very easy at the end you can also uh, if you wanted to have that uh, size and width if you wanted to have a you know change you can do the resize also as well let's say size i'm increasing to 50 and uh, this i'm just selecting only whatever the things you selected it will come there and uh, so color custom themes also you can do it for example custom things you again you can go and have a click uh, on this so this is how we, which you can create that fishbone diagram using xmind let's go to the another topic let's say i wanted to create one more like go to new just save the file save as the file when you save as the file so it will give like in this uh, format way in which you can go ahead and do it that is uh, one way dot x mind it will give and uh, similarly you wanted to open a new library new tab a new library you can just have a go and uh, let's say this time i'm just taking the nutritional value that i find it very useful uh, so green food all the green foods whatever the green foods we have and what are the nutritional value like i'm just maximizing the screen and i'm opening up this one it has uh, it has come big now what i will do i will just have a multicolor. it will be even more interesting and then if you wanted to have a slightly compact map you can also do that right so and then what i'm doing is so this is the value like 
uh, potassium, magnesium, and zinc, silver, and uh, sodium, and all that. What what vegetable it has contained like onion, watermelon, grapes, uh, and all that. So easily you can map out this also as well. Similarly, if you wanted to have any other example, you can do it also as well. Let's say one last example. Like whatever the uh, your business case or whatever the reason you can make use of it. Uh, let's say my wish list, right? We wanted to create. We wanted to create simple table but very curve, you know, colorful, right? So if you wanted to create that, still you can do it. So for example, let's say, uh, so this is, uh, uh, let's say you wanted to create my wish list, right? You wanted to create, uh, let's say I wanted to create more videos, more knowledgeable videos. videos and we want to particularly uh, wanted to create an iso example right whatever whatever the headers and all that we can change it even these icons we can change it right all of these things can be easily done so this is all about xmind and uh, once again this xmind is being taught more from the application perspective not on the ad perspective as well. so please do like share subscribe my channel you have wonderful day.